welcome to Premier Wrestling. Another fantastic week of amazing matches. I'm Ryan Jameson alongside Mace. What's up, Mace? How you doing this week? Hey, hey, Ryan. Uh, pretty good. I hear we got some good matches going on this week. Oh, yeah. Not just good, they're incredible. It has been three weeks, Jasmine. Three weeks. Come on. Just go sit in the locker room, Johnny. I'm doing the best I can, Johnny. Vince is a good businessman and just looking out for you. He doesn't want to see you get hurt again. Yeah, right. Ooh. Yeah, bitch. Huh? Huh? Yeah. Yeah, motherfucker. Oh. Yeah, oh. take that. Take that. You son of a bitch. Think you're better than me. Huh? I'm king around here. I'm top dog around here, bitch. I am top dog around here. Here, you stupid motherfucker. Bedtime, bitch. Bedtime. Huh? You think you're better than me, huh? You think you're better than me? Yeah, I'm not supposed to piece of shit. You dumb fuck. Get away from me. Get out, get away from me. I'll do to him what I'll do to you too. That's it. That's it. Your wings are being plucked, motherfucker. <laughs> I'll make it going after uh, Johnny and smashing him to the ground. They put him in that sleeper hold and basically lullabied his ass right to sleep. Yeah, he did. He went right to sleep, right down on the floor. Exactly, exactly. Wow. Oh, that was all kind of for though. I mean, come on, Omega. I thought that Omega was a better man than that. You know, this time I might have to agree with you because that was definitely uncalled for because jo Johnny is still, still has not been cleared. This might push it back more, but it looks like Johnny's getting a little frustrated with the treatment he's getting, not letting them, you know, not telling him when. No, I don't think it's steroids there. I don't think it's steroids at all. Definitely not that because I've watched this man work out and I don't Never know. Steroid but this match is turning is, gonna be, is turning out to be it's gonna turn out to be a good one. We have Isaiah, the Hornet, Jenkins, some of our new talent just coming up through the system. I mean, he's got a big test ahead of him versus the Hunter. Uh -huh. I don't think he's gonna be able to take the Hunter out. Well, I don't know. See, we do, this is a new uh, new fresh meat here, so <laughs> exactly. We'll know. Exactly, but the fact of the matter is, he hasn't had a chance to get to know the people, get to know his opponent, and that could be a detriment. Because, and of course, with rookies, you always have those "quote unquote" rookie mistakes. Wow! Looks like he just vaulted himself over that top rope. Look at that! Very full of. He looks like he, he may end up being a high flyer. The hunter may have to watch out for that. And here we go. The Hunter standing six foot five, weighing 260. You've got to watch. Those two moves can definitely, definitely take you out. He puts that on you, that's it. You're done. Mm -hmm. Seriously. But like I said, I want to see what this kid can do against 
the more experienced hunter. If anything, even if he loses, he could learn something from, a, from the veteran wrestling against the veteran. That's the only, that's one thing that I, I could give you that. He will learn something. And maybe not make, if he makes mistakes, maybe not make as many mistakes as he's done.
Flash in Premier Wrestling. Oh, that that definitely rocked Hunter. He, he is getting very, very. Ooh. Oh, beautiful kick to the gut. Mm -hmm. He's got him in a beautiful front face lock. He's just wrenching on that neck and head. Oh, he's got him set up for oh, something. Yeah. Uh oh. Here you go. Oh. Ooh. Beautiful pile driver driving the head and neck of the hunter into the canvas. That has definitely got to hurt. That is definitely going to make, make him think twice. I think Hunter's definitely have to rethink this match. I don't think he expected the young gun to come out like he's come out. Okay, it's looking at this. Looks like we got a, a st he's, looks like, he, oh, he's kneeling off. Go for the cover, kid. Go for the cover. Here we go. We've got a, another hook. in for the cover. One, two, just two, a two only count. Only a two. Oh, wow. If he had gotten into the cover quicker, he might have been able to have him. He might have been able to have that match. Oh, come on. You don't need to taunt him. That's just going to aggravate the hunter. Hunter. Mm. Wow, he's up. He looks like he's a little bit stunned. Doesn't look like he's got that far and away look in his eyes. Oh, oh, look, at oh look at that back suplex. Beautiful. This kid. I'm in shock. I am in shock. This guy is showing something here today. Oh, yeah. He is definitely showing that he knows what he's doing. But like I said, he's got to keep on. He's got to keep on, Hunter. He's got to keep oh, on him. Where are they? Uh, two count. Couple of stomps. But he's, he should cover. He should go for the cover right now. If I was, if he was, hmm. he was smart. There he goes there into the goes. cover. One, two. Uh, only a two, only a two. Wow. This kid's definitely impressed. I am impressed. I'm not a wrestler, but I am impressed with what this kid is doing. But he's got to keep on him. He can't let him get that breath back into his body. That mistake right there could, call could end up causing him to match. Well, yeah, guaranteed. Oh, big Whoa. stomp, big stomp. Big kick to the gut. Oh, yeah. Hunter got some... Uh... Strength back, get him. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, another, oh, another kick. Another kick. Wow. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, looks like he's setting him up for a possible power bomb. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Oh, Ooh. beautiful reversal into a Hurricane Rana. Beautiful. My God, this kid's definitely got skills. I'm, I'm enjoying this match. I thought this would be an easy match for Hunter, right. but I, I am impressed. Not. I am really impressed by this now, new one. Exactly, but wait. When you saw this, didn't you I, think this would be an that, easy I match for the Hunter? Well, yeah, when I first saw it. Oh, he caught him with that Hunter's kick right in the mouth, coming off the ropes. So he had the extra force coming off them ropes. Like I said, a few little rookie mistakes may cost this rook his yeah. match. It could. That's the only thing. You when you go up against a professor. When, when you go up against somebody who's been in the ring and you're just a rookie, you gotta, you know, you gotta take your time. You gotta figure out what you're doing. Oh, he's posing up there. He's looking. He's looking to hit something big. Uh, here we go. Oh, oh diving axe handle right. Uh top of the head. Hey, it's right on top of his head. I bet definitely, you definitely definitely get a ring. I wonder if his ears are ringing. <laughs> and it ain't his telephone. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Hell, Clay, you get oh, look at this. He's pulled him, pull, he pull him into the middle of the ring. He looks like he's going to end this. I've got a feeling this is definitely going to be ending. Oh, a couple of big stomps. 
I think this kid's just about had it. He, he gave it a good, he definitely gave it a good. Uh, here we go with the pin. Let's see what happens here. One, two. Only a, a two, count. two count. Wow. Maybe the kid's got more uh, more gas to tank than we thought of, but Hunter looks like he's in tip top condition. The Hornet, I mean, the kid's good, but he can always get better. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, uh, uh, oh, look at it. Oh, an airplane spin. He is spinning and just drops him. Now, yeah. not only does that spin you around, you, you forget where you are, but you get dropped. It's, that, it's not the drop that hurts, it's that sudden stop at the end of it. Yeah, I hear you. Oh, he is all yeah, sorts of wobbly. Looks, yeah, he looks like I think this. I think this is the end, the beginning of the end for him. Oh, there we go. Here we go. There we go. That's that's done. That's done. That, he hit that. Like I said. Oh, clear. I think he grounded him too. Oh yeah. It looks like this kid's got got the ability go. to be a high Another flyer. Pin. One, two. Only a two count. Two count. Wow. An inverted backbreaker did a lot, a lot of damage on him. Like I said, oh, he's getting up, but he looks like he looks like he's had it. This has got to. If I, I have a yeah. feeling, Hunter, being the man that he is, he's going to take care of him. He got, he got to be tired. Oh, there you go. Oh. That's done. The hunter's trap. <laughs> oh, look at this. Uh, there we go. There's a pin. One, two. two. Three. Three, that's it. Uh, there's your winner, you know, ladies you know, and gentlemen. You know, once he once he hit that that hunter's trap, that was it for him. But I'm telling you, definitely good showing by the rookie. I am impressed completely for him to come out here and give the hunter a run oh, for his money I like he did. What though? He did give a good show. That 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 young oh, look at this. right there. Look at this. The hunter that, is showing sportsmanship. He helps a little. He helps his opponent up. Right, but that young man right there is going to become someone. I guarantee. Oh yeah, he is definitely somebody to watch for. I tell you, looks like looks like the hunter was impressed by his opponent, by by his skills. And wow, he helped him up. Had a few words for him. Mm -hmm. I tell you, looks like the new guy has definitely got the hunter's approval. He is not a bad man to have the approval of. The hunter can teach him a lot. If he has high flying abilities, that's going to add to his arsenal. Listen to listen to him, hunter. Listen to him, Hornet. Listen to the uh, hunter. Look at that. Look, listen to this crowd. I'll tell you what they love this here uh, new exactly. guy or and hunter. So I mean, this is going to be something interesting to be watching and, and uh, exactly. looking out for. Exactly. If if the if that if the Hornet listens to the Hunter, to what he says, show you know does what he shows him to do. This kid, he's got a limited potential. He goes high as, as high as starts. Who knows? You may be looking at him as a light heavyweight champion or as a champion down the road. Service. It's exclusively for people looking for long-term relationships in Second Life. Panels are available to everyone. And our second floor is dedicated to the bonders and community. Starting out is easy. Just fill out the questionnaire to the best of your ability. And although we cannot guarantee a match, if you answer honestly, you will have a good chance at finding your soulmate. We will be having events which will be open exclusively to group members, and the group is free to join. We have a beautiful area with beaches, a restaurant, and shady places to sit where you can meet your matches and get to know them in a safe environment. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact Jasmine Trice for more information. Forever love, find your match with us. I'm not positive we will have him, we will have BJ O'Hare sitting at the commentary desk with us, sharing some insights about does the mean, Reverend. Does that mean that uh, LB, <laughs> LG brought in uh, some of his Reverend people? Seriously? Nah. All right, no, no, because remember the last time that when JW faced BJ, he baptized him. So that means he's probably a, a um, maybe a deacon. 
with the Reverend. Help the Reverend out. Well, that's Burger all people. But like I said, that, that match between JW and Brandon, XE Toad, is going to be a good match. Brandon hasn't been around in a while. He, he's back and he's hungry for a win, but the Reverend uh, might know. have, he's probably going to have other ideas. Yeah, I guarantee you JW has other ideas. Who knows? Maybe he might baptize Brandon. <laughs> that, I'll tell you, that'd be great. Two baptisms in two weeks. Oh, I'm loving it. But like I said, you know, the first two matches, I mean, we've had a great start to the show. I'm having a lot of fun. Oh, yeah. Me too. Uh, here he comes. Here he comes. Um, Oh, come on! You know, you know, you know. JW, JW's uh, one of your favorite people. Who me? Yeah, Not you. Me. Oh no, I don't do the preaching thing. Oh, there he goes. Oh, look at these! Ain't he cute? Hey, he's got a pro. He's got a pose. Oh, look at this. Look and here up. comes the Reverend James W. Beeswing from Kyoto, Oklahoma, standing 6'10", weighing in at a hefty 375. You gotta watch out for that divine intervention. <laughs> yeah! We do. Anyway. Ah, here. And here he comes, BJ. Welcome to the commentator desk. Get comfortable, relax, have fun with us. Hey, BJ, I like your shirt, dude. You know that, right? About as much, about as much as I, you know. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, you finally got the superstar on the desk, and I'm here to tell you, the Pastor James is the man of the hour, the man sent by the higher power, the man to bring down the tower of sin here in Premier Wrestling. Uh, you sure Pete. about this? Preach it, brother BJ. Preach it. Lord, let it all out. Like a liar. So this is all true. Are you sure about that? Amen, like, brother BJ. Amen. Why are, you, why are you questioning me again? I said it is the truth. Oh, uh -huh. okay. We'll see. I, I, BJ, I believe you 100. percent I know. I know the reverend oh, speaks you the shut truth. Up. You shut up. You believe. You believe anybody that. Uh, that uh, likes to buy people and gives you a crown. Hold it. Make you think you're the king. Uh, hold Hell it, hold what? it. I wasn't, I was that crown wasn't given to me. I bought that. But like I said, listen to the hey, reverend. He will lead you into the light. Gentlemen, let's keep the focus where it belongs. It's on the reverend, the, the pastor, James. Because like it says in Ephesians 6, verse 12, for we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Premier Wrestling is those high places, and Muscle Beast Baptist, led by Pastor oh. Beatwing, is on a holy crusade, and you see it right there in the ring. Oh, here we go again with this here crusade. Amen. Come on, now. You Amen, guys, you Brother guys BJ. Have, you guys must have come from LG, because that dude does the same thing, and you know what? The only thing no, he... LG don't he, preach. LG don't preach. The, LG the only preach. thing he lord of is... You know, uh, I'm not going to say because, you know, I don't want to get it for slander. But anyway, let's watch this here wrestling match and let's get it over with. Yes, and let's see Pastor Beeswing be in charge with Brandon Exito down on the mat. Exactly. You know, I just got to say, as a converted man, like two weeks ago, I was shown the light. Oh, looks like we've got a pin. Only Earl a one count. Only no, a one count. Earl was definitely possessed by a demon there. That should have been a three count. Uh, not this early. But them demons, they possessed Earl. They said, no, you ain't going to count yet. But I'm here to tell all these people, Pastor James comes here in front of all you nice people and, and about the people watching on the YouTube because it says in 1 Timothy 6, verse 12, fight the good fight of the faith. Take hold of the eternal life to which you were called when you made your good confession in the presence of many witnesses. 
<laughs> Amen to that. Oh, looks like uh, Brandon is taking the Reverend down. I tell you, I've got faith. Damn. I've got more than enough faith. I know the Reverend's going to take this match. He ain't going to have no problems with this. It all will be as the Lord wills it. Brandon Exito with a beautiful DDT, but I know that the pastor might be seeing stars, but he's got the light of the Lord upon him. Come on, Brandon. Let's show them who's boss here. Uh, oh, listen to this biased commentator. Yo, there's no bias in me. You literally were just cheering for Brandon Exito. Oh, sh you were cheering for the opponent. You gotta be unbiased. Root for both, root for none. That's the way it's supposed to be. Now, I can oh, be no, biased no, no, because no. I am here for the Lord. Yo, okay. You can be biased all right. I, I can't be biased. Preach it, I'm BJ. Preach it. You are a professional commentator. Supposedly professional. Ah. Oh, beautiful Irish whip off the ropes. Hmm. Oh. Oh, that had to hurt. That spear coming off the ropes. You see, and that, that is the way to do it, Pastor. Because Pastor James only does what the Lord brings him to do. In Jeremiah 51, verse 20, it says, You are my war club, my weapon for battle. There we go. There we go. He's got him up look, over his head. He's got him up on. over his head. He's going to drop him right on his face. There it is Come with on. Pastor. With no. Pastor James, I destroy kingdoms. And Brandon Exito going for a flight. Hey, does he have his pilot's license? He shouldn't be flying if he ain't got that. But I know hey. one thing. The Reverend is definitely wearing the armor of the Lord. Why don't you guys give somebody a break? You two, you two uh, talk about the Lord and all this other stuff. Behave yourself. Everything is of the Lord, sir. Everything. And look, here's a pin. This is the Lord's pin. Let's see if the demons are out of Earl. Oh, oh. only a two count. I'm guessing not. Maybe Earl needs to be baptized next. Uh, yes, you've got to drive the demons out of him. Earl, the power of Christ compelled you to count to three. They, now they're going to pick on the ref. Go figure. Two idiots. No, we ain't picking on the ref. We are not picking on the ref. We're just giving him some um, some advice. There you go, some advice. Uh, <laughs> okay, whatever. Anyway, oh. let's, get the, let's watch these people. These guys are Brandon doing a good job. going down south on that kick. That looked a little Brandon. low there, Earl. Oh, yeah. That definitely was a low blow. I, you know, I can hey, see that coming hey, from no, Brandon. No, no one saw that. No, no, yeah, the, the referee didn't even see that. That's because oh the referee's God. blinded by sin. Yeah, he blinded the bias, him. Mate? Do you hear the bias coming out of your voice? Hey. The demons no. have possessed me. I'm, t I'm, just telling it, to I'm just telling it like I see it. And right now, uh... That was a good kick. Anyway. Well, the thing is, you weren't, you weren't up in the ring. You couldn't tell where that, where that hit. That could have hit low. It could have. No. That's all right. I don't know. I don't, JW looks like hurt. he's a, a little breathing heavy there. Maybe well, if you, were, if you were in that ring, you'd probably be breathing heavy too. This might be a mistake. Brandon backing up like that, that may definitely be a mistake. Just remember, oh. this is unfair. Unfair match for Brandon oh. because with the Lord, it is always a handicap match. Come on, Brandon. Show him who's boss now. Let's go. Brandon is down because the Lord wills it. That that looked that looked like a hammer coming coming at Brandon, hitting him right in the face. Man, man, man oh man. And ladies and gentlemen, if you want to be converted, if you want to mm. be baptized by the Pastor James, all you gotta do is put your hands up and give your life to the Lord. Please. Anyway, see, mate, you're oh, just. I'd be, I'd be more than, I'd be more than happy to be baptized. Some, something's going down here. Uh, oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, sure. Wow, that looks like a hammer. Now I'm going to pound him in the face. That's a hammer look. coming off the door. Pastor JW is looking for that divine intervention, and he is going to bear down Brandon Nick Vito. Oh, yeah. Come on, come on Brandon, yeah. hit him again. I mean, come on, the dude's right there. Just Maybe after just looking at the divine intervention, Brandon, Brandon will decide he needs, he has seen the light and he will come into the fold. That is the great thing about the Lord. At any moment, you could be converted. You could be shown the light. Oh. That's what happened to me two weeks ago. 
I remember when that happened. It tugged on my doing? heart seeing you, seeing you converted, seeing you give yourself over to the Lord. I'm telling you, that made me feel real good about being here. Uh, come on, brother. Get some, uh, get some, uh, get up and go there. I mean, the dude's see, down I, here. His, the dude's his, on his knees. Get down there and show him what knees are for. He's out, He's down on his knee praying, showing reverence to the Almighty. Yeah, okay. Brandon looking like he's a little wobbly on his feet. Maybe he's been hitting too much of the uh, the altar wine. Come on, Brandon, get him. He's already down there. Uh oh. Oh, that looked like a oh, low blow. Yeah. That looked like a low that's blow. A way, that's the way to do it. Okay, get the. Oh, yeah, look at him. He just pulled that man up there like nothing. Yeah. Oh, I see. I see. I see you got uh, lost. Uh, things but that, that, that poster looks like the cross that the Savior oh. was hung on. Oh, that was nice. Come on, Ben. You got it. Yeah, see, that was yeah. a big throw. And, and let's be honest. Brandon, so, okay, here's, here's a pin. Head. Let's see. One, two, three. There you no. go. No. no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No. Don't go Jesus, there. Mate. Calm down. Calm there down. That was not he, free, girl. That him. was not free. Uh, no way. No way. He there beat him. No. no. That is crazy. How yeah. can he get oh, that right. above his head? Way to go. Way to go, Brandon. You showed him. You done showed him. Hey, you know, it happens. I, I'm now hearing what it is. I am getting a vision. The Lord gave Pastor James a holy mission to suffer as Christ suffered. Yeah, well, Amen. Well, Amen well, to that, well, brother. Well, Amen. And, preach and, on. Let, let me, let me Lord, preach on. Let me preach hey, on. Hey, the Lord didn't help him now. The Lord is always helping. He's he not me. He's he not me. No, 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 don't go there with me. Don't go there with me. He got beaten, and, and he had the Lord on his side, but he hey, still got hey. me. Don't go let there. Me up. Let, me, let me hit you with a little verse. As it says in Micah 7, verse 8, Do not gloat over me, my enemy. Though I have fallen, I will rise. So I sit in darkness the oh, Lord. Oh, well, so then, we're going, then, then we're going to... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Then we'll we're going to have to wait. The reverend's got a microphone. Let's we're going to have to wait for another day for the, him to be... Hey, the pastor has a microphone, mate. Show some respect. Let's listen to what he says. Uh, he, will, he, will, he will give you some inspiration to change your evil ways. Not my evil ways. All right, let's hear the man. Okay, I'm I'm waiting to hear from this man. Well, give him a second, mate. He just went through a hard match. And the Lord's putting into his heart what he uh, needs to say right now. Okay. I'll be patient. No, patience, patience is a virtue. So you're not virtuous. I love you, Brandon. The Lord told me to suffer like Christ and to lay down my life for you, just as Christ laid down his life for me. So I beg you, Brandon, come be a part of this family. Come. And join me in glorious splendor, brother, so I can save your soul from hell. Because let's face it, we all know I could whip you ten ways till Sunday. But I chose not to. I showed mercy. Because where mercy is shown, mercy is given, my brother. Amen. Amen. The words from the pastor and whether victory or loss. 12 verse 19 says, do not take revenge, my dear friends, but leave room for God's wrath, for it is written, it is mine to avenge, I will oh, repay. So oh, please, put that out on the flyer, maybe these people out here might want to hear it. I'm about to go back to the back, I'm going to find out now, the strongest word there is next to the word of God. Are you planning your wedding but don't know where to start? Let us plan your dream day for you. 
I'll Be With You Weddings offers many breathtaking, elegant, and uniquely created wedding venues that can be customized to your liking, as well as complete, full-service wedding packages that won't break your bank. Our coordinators will take you from consultation to your wedding day and be with you every step of the way. Experienced officiants will write a customized ceremony just for you, and no two ceremonies will be alike. And our photographers will capture your wedding day forever with their creative photography. With many years of wedding planning experience in both real life and second life, trust the experts at I'll Be With You Wedding, Second Life's most trusted go-to wedding agency since 2014. Contact Jenny Love, the wedding expert, or stop by the main store and speak with an available agent located on Lavender Island. Hello, are you tired of sitting back watching the action? Well, did you know Premier Wrestling is currently hiring? Go to our website for details. Yeah, it's the middleweight champion for your info team. And it, and it is our first championship match we are having here. <laughs> Miss Phoenix, you got there. I, I love swinging. You want to swing, honey? You, you, are you free to, after the show? <laughs> Oh, I better keep my mind where, well, I, I have to keep my mind on my job. Sorry about that. Oh, look at this. Oh, here, here he is. Ace. Here he is. The man. The ace. Oh, sweetie, you don't know what I can handle. Anyway. Okay, enough of that. Be professional. I am. Like BJ said you're supposed to be professional. Not I am the fans. I'm hey. I, I take up the challenge. Anyway, here's the uh, the ace man. I tell you, I know Ace has worked very, very hard for this rematch. He has wanted this rematch for a long time. He has worked for it, and he has earned the match. Well, I'll tell you what. I, I, I've watched, I have been watching Phil do his thing, and uh, this man, I feel, deserves the title. So, okay, I'll anyway. give you that. You're, they're both deserving because they both got through the tournament. Like I said, this is, gonna, this is going to be a. What, oh, what, this is going to be a, the best matches. Best matches. Hey, crawl now here in this thing. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Look at this. There he goes. Hey. I like that. Yeah, he's six foot four. 249, we've got the ace in the ring. Coming out now, we've got Bill the Grave Bowler from Hamburg, Germany, standing six foot four, 242 pounds. And Bill's got that super kick work for him, but you've got to watch out for the black mark and the blackout. Ace has marked many, many people. Yeah. With that. I think, I think, uh, I think, uh, poor, uh, Phil there had a bum deal a couple times, so hey, hey look, he let, look, so, what's that stick? Bill's supposed to get a weapon into the ring? Right? What the heck is that all about? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you know, get rid of that stick. He looks like he's about ready to maybe uh, use it on Ace. <laughs> oh, there we go. A little bit of jaw jack, a little bit of jaw jack. Hey, he's telling the ref. To stay out of his way, and he better get in the damn ring because he wants to get this fight started. And this is what we've all been waiting for: middleweight championship, the ace against Bill the Grave Bowler. These two do not like each other in the least bit. This is this is going to be this this is worth the price of admission right here. Just this one match. All right, yeah, we're going checking. We're checking for all kinds of uh, things that uh, could hurt somebody. A knife, a, a weapon, a shotgun. You know. All right, look it. Hey, he's giving him the word. Ring that bell. Let's get this match underway. But like I said, you know, this is going to be. One who wins is one who really wants this. You have to really 
really want this match. Yippers. I'll, I'll watch this. Oh. 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 Oh, jeez. Ace is really pounding Wow. Oh, yeah. He, he's out to an aggressive start. He's not letting him. He, he, uh, Phil did show him. Let's see what he Oh. 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 Phil's oh. giving it back. Look at that. Phil's giving it back to okay, him. Okay, you know. All right. That's not a bad. But now, oh, wow. That's an aggressive start. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, there you go. There you go. Few rights, few lefts. Rear, maybe need some dental work afterwards. Oh, beautiful! He's got he's got Phil hung up against him ropes. Here he comes off the ropes. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that's the way to do it, Phil. Just wow, wow! Throw, Big throw, back throw body over drop it. over the rope. Throw oh, him come over. On. He's giving him, he's he's giving the ace time. Oh, look at that! He's Don't. holding his back. Then you give him ace time for nothing. Look, ace gave him back in there. Yeah, but Phil, Phil just might have made a big mistake that could end up losing the match for him. He let Ace get his breath again. Oh, beautiful super kick off the apron. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> now he's holding uh -oh. the Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Here goes Phil. Come on, Phil, do it. Come on, Ace. Get up. Get up, Ace. Come on, Phil, do it. Ooh. Come on, Ace. Get up. Oh, man, he's a little bit wobbly. Uh -oh. Phil, you're giving them too much time there, don't you? Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh. A flying lariat. Wow. All right, the, the ref is killing wow. you guys there. So hurry up, put them back in the ring or get in the ring and do something. Oh. Oh. Uh oh. All right. Well, the yeah, quote of famous what... commentator, I know this is turning into a real slobber knocker here. Ow. Looks like, besides getting punched upside the head, rights and lefts, he had the, uh, oh, first he's back Ooh. off the steps. And oh, yeah, you got him. Right across, across the eyes. The oh, look at his snake eyes right off the top of the steps. Wow. Oh. Oh. Wow. He just sort of whipped him over there to the Whoa. Up over the steps into that barricade. That's got. That's definitely gonna hurt. Hurt the. Oh, oh, oh! Looks like Phil made a slight <laughs> mistake. Ace gets Whoa. out the way, and it looks like uh, Phil might have speared the barricade. I don't know. The ref is up to four, so they better start uh, working their way back into the ring. Exactly, because we don't want, we definitely don't want this to end it. Oh, 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 beautiful, beautiful. Come yeah. on, Ace, you don't need to taunt, you don't need to taunt. I'll tell you, they've got, they've got to get back in the ring, because we definitely do not want a double count out. The fans are loving this match, they are going off the wall, they're going nuts. A lot of action right, outside the ring, inside the ring. Yeah, come on, this here. Oh, hey, this wait. How something's up. Yeah. Hey, Mace, something's up. This, this ref is, seems to have lost control of this match. We got to get, we got to get, he's got to get back into control. I know, right? Look at this. He's letting him what, go up. Yeah, he just, I mean, he's not uh, counting fast enough for me. It's hard to say, but. Exactly. Oh, beautiful, beautiful gut kick. Ooh, beautiful kick to the guts, to the, to right, right to Ace's oh. midsection. Okay. All right, who's the ref? How about getting them back in line? I'm Come on, ref. Rare. Do your Get job. In the ring. Ooh, oh, drop kick. beautiful drop kick, right into the ladder. Wow, that had to hurt. Oh. Oh, right Come on, now. Rev. Show that you've got show that you've got a set. Oh make them get back oh, into sure. the ring. There's the suplex right there. Alright, come on. Uh Phil. 
Get back Come in. On. Get back in the in the. Come in on. The... We don't need to count out for a championship match. You guys gotta get your get your backsides back into that ring. Yeah. All right. Seriously, where did that letter come from? Are we having uh, light problems or something up there? I have no idea. I don't remember seeing that ladder here earlier. Oh, Ace's head right off the ladder. Oh. Wow. I don't know, Badika, but well, oh, uh, Mr. Rap, why are you still here? Why are you back here with us, Mr. Rap? You're supposed to be up there <laughs> on stage. Hey, you're supposed to control in ring. Get in there and control it. Yeah, right. Get up these there two in guys the get hurt, and, it's going to be all on you. Get back uh, there and do your job. Hmm. Seriously. Oh, look oh, at him. He's, he's oh, he's bringing, going uh -oh. running bacon for... What the hell? What, what kind of ref is this? Is he, is he bought? I bet you... Hold it, hold it, hold it. The, the, the ref is looking at the dang belt. The ref is looking at the belt. Hold it. Did I, did I just... Did he just call for the bell? The ref is calling for the bell. The ref is calling for the bell. Uh-oh. I don't know. I don't know, but this ref lost, lost control of this here. Oh, yeah. He lost match. control of... He lost control of... I think he even have control from the beginning of the match. Oh, look at this. You've got to be kidding. Uh-oh. This can't be good. Uh, this cannot be good. He's, they got him laid across hey, the table. I did not ask oh. for... I did not ask for Ace for Somebody... Two. Somebody... Somebody... Somebody help, somebody help out here. Get, get some help oh, out here. Hey, look at this. I'm what, on the ladder. Uh-oh. No. 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 Okay, Phil, let's do it. Do it to it. Uh, he's got, Ace, Ace right. must have sensed something was going on, and he rolled out of the way. Um, Come on, Rev. Oh, get over you, here. I think this Rev, I think the Rev was bought. I'm, I'm, I'm just telling you, because you were bought, I bet you that Rev was bought, too. Anyway. I don't think so. I don't think so. He just lost control. He just couldn't control these two. Uh-oh, Ace has got the chair. We got ourselves yeah. a standoff up here. We got, uh, so oh, he got, a, he got a chair and fills in the air. If, if, that Phil comes off the, if Phil comes off that ladder, Ace can turn around and clock him right in the head as soon as he comes off the ladder. Well, if Phil comes off of that ladder and hits him, guaranteed he ain't going to have that there damn chair uh, very long in his hand. Yeah, but thing is, a coming off the ladder, Ace has time to prepare. He can just step out of the way and swing that chair like a... Uh oh, oh the, here she comes, the GM, GM, with security. With, with, oh, her, with her bodyguard. Okay, All right, let's see what our oh. GM has to say. Oh. Cut hey. my music. Cut my music. You know, I am getting just a little bit sick and tired of people around here. This is my show. My show. Do you people understand what that means? Now... Anybody that doesn't know me here, in case you people don't know, I am Jasmine Trice. I am the general manager of Premier Wrestling. And as the general manager, I am going to say this match will go on. Okay? This is going to happen one way or the other. So... Since you guys want to go all out of control, take things upon yourselves, and do whatever you want, you will meet up again. This match for the middleweight title will go on. And you know what? It's going to go on next week. Mm. But. <laughs> oh, there had to be a but. And anybody yeah. that knows me knows I don't do anything plain. Nothing's regular. Especially not a middleweight title match. So, <clears throat> gentlemen, <laughs> this match is going to need something a little better. A little more edgy. I think since you have an affinity for chairs and ladders let's make it a TLC match a Whoa. table ladders oh. and chairs match 
for the middleweight championship. Gentlemen, wow. have fun. Because next week, we're all going to have fun. Mm. We're going to have fun, won't you? Well, well the but, GM are has spoken. Wow, what a twist on this match. That's going to make that match even more exciting. You definitely want to be here to see that. Wow, TLC championship. Oh, yeah. Can't wait. It's going to definitely be exciting and interesting. So be sure to be here next week. Oh, Whoa. Look, he just Whoa. flew off of the ladder. Looks like a flying forearm. Wow. Oh, I did not actually. expect that. Mm -mm. Oh, looks like looks like Ace's head is definitely spinning. He's holding that head. Just hope he's not he's not there's no blood coming down. Right. <laughs> All right, Lou. Hey Phil, good job. Now, you understand what you gotta do next week, right? Oh, he wants a mic. Then hand hand him a mic. Here you go. Take mine. Oh, Ace, that really nice try. Now you will hear what is going on next week. TLC match for the title I always deserved. And it will happen. It is always be mine. And it will be mine. You got that? See ya next week. Wow, mm. strong words from Phil saying that. It's always been his. Yes, sir. And I know Ace has never been I able feel, to beat the match, but I think, I think Ace is... I feel, I feel the same way. Uh, Phil does deserve it. Phil's been knocked down, kicked out, and dragged out, and all kinds of... He deserves it. But thing is, even though Ace has never beat Phil in a match, that could always change, because as you and I both agree, one thing we agree on is the fact that it can... Anything can happen. Mm -hmm. Anything can happen at any hey, time. That's what we warn our fans and our public about is anything can happen in uh, Premier Wrestling. Anything. You can, All you got to do is be here. All you got to do is be here. Check us out on Facebook. Join us. Join us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. And also, if you're in world, come check us out live. You definitely got to check us out live. You saw the action today. Pictures sitting there ringside watching this. And don't forget, this match is brought to you by Forever Love. Oh, yeah, Forever Love between them two, not going to happen. But Forever Love, contact our very own GM, Jasmine Trice, for more info. Like I said, for Twitter, go to https colon forward slash forward slash twitter.com slash premier wrestle one. Okay. Hey. Of course, we do our, our fan group on Facebook, our YouTube channel, or at, you know, if you see anybody that you know from wrestling, ask them. We'll be sure to be able, we'll be sure to pass off the information to you. All right. Uh, don't you don't want to miss this show? So. Oh yeah, especially especially not next week. It's gonna be we got that that TLC match for right. the championship. Oh, man. All right. Exciting. Base, like I said, great work with you again. We might not, we will agree to disagree. We agree on something, yeah. but mostly we disagree. Yeah. Uh, you go like I said, if, if you ever need a loan, just ask, no interest, don't even have to pay it back.